Hey everyone, it's Jess with Jess Lux Homes and Keller Williams Realty here with you today for another episode of Fresh from the Farm. It's still really nice outside, thank goodness, but farmers are doing farmery things which are noisy outside. So we're gonna hang out inside the house for this week's episode where I wanted to tell you a little bit about what's happening in the market. To set the stage a little bit, I need to tell you a few things about the spring and summer market that we have had. I looked back at the statistics for Dane County, Wisconsin, and noticed that overall, 45% of listings sold or currently under contract had competing offers. For Just Like's Homes, that number was actually 82% if you can believe it. So it's been a very, very crazy market the last few months. 103% of asking price is the average that, that homeowners have received on their listings, and most homes have sold within 16 days. To paint the picture on the buyer side, I worked with about 19 buyers this year that were serious about buying a home and writing offers. And since working with those buyers, I wrote 80 offers for those 19 buyers. That's about 4.2 offers per buyer. Some buyers had the luck of only writing one offer, while other buyers wrote upwards of 12 or 13 offers. I wanna give you a couple of stories of two buyers that I worked with this past spring season. One buyer was probably on her 11th offer, and she was running up against a deadline where she needed to have a house and she needed to have a house quickly or things weren't gonna be good. She was kind of facing homelessness in a way. Um, and so this buyer decided to give writing a sight unseen offer a shot. We found a property in her ideal neighborhood that was coming soon, so not yet on the market. There was only one picture, just the front of the house. And we reached out to that agent and said, hey, are you interested in looking at sight unseen offers? And they initially told us, no, we're not interested in that. But when I told them the type of offer that my buyer was willing to write, they said, well, send it over to us. So we sent it over probably within five or six hours, only to find out that that agent must have reached out to some of the other people that had connected with him and told them that they were now looking at sight unseen offers because that seller ended up with three sight unseen offers when about 12 hours beforehand, they were telling us they weren't looking at those. Luckily for that buyer, the 12th offer was the ticket and she was able to be the one to get the home under contract. The second buyer that I wanted to tell you about wrote several offers as well. I think she maybe wrote 10 or 11. And when we finally got one accepted, I had called her up to break the news to her and First she said, yay, that's awesome. And then she said, which house was it again? Because buyers were out writing so many offers that they just couldn't even keep track of what houses they were writing offers on anymore. Anyways, I wanted to flip the script a little bit because this fall season is shaping up to be a little bit better. I put two buyers under contract in the last couple of weeks and have been able to get inspections negotiated for those buyers. I've been able to get low down payment, financing contingencies accepted, and it's just been a little bit of a different picture. I'm not gonna say the buyers aren't competing still, but the, the offers that are being chosen are just not quite as drastic, thankfully. So, if you were scared away by this year's spring market, I want to let you know that right now is buyer season. I would encourage you to hop back into the pool. Let's start looking at some more homes and let's see what we can get you into before the spring rush starts again in 2022. This has been another episode of Fresh from the Farm with Jess of Jess Lex Homes. See you next week.